Welcome to this Windows 10 and computer channel and uh, this is another video in the series of what should you do after you buy that new computer. We talked about clean install, we talked about fresh start to remove the crap, we've talked about updating Windows, we've talked about a few things to do on that new computer to make it running the best that it can. Well, now one of the things you should do is install your favorite browser and this is very personal a lot of people say what's the best browser it's the one you use honestly um, of course if you're thinking of using Internet Explorer I would probably say well it's time to move on to something else but that's where it is once again manufacturers will try to push you into a specific software most of the time they might install Firefox by default or Chrome by default or, you know, just try to lure you into some browser. Remember that when you clean install, if you've did some of the steps that I talked and you clean installed, well, you have no other browser than the basic browser that Windows 10 gives you, which is Microsoft Edge. Now there are, you know, Microsoft Edge is actually being phased out slowly for a new version, which is a Chromium version. And we're not talking about that here because that's for, uh, you know, tech enthusiasts. We're talking here, you'll need to go and get yourself your browser, your favorite browser that you have. And that means that you'll be using that, you know, I, I get that joke all the time on the channel. Yeah, I'm using Edge to download my favorite browser, like Chrome or whatever. So I'll just have to download whatever uh, browser you want. The most popular, of course, is Chrome. The second most popular, or pretty much, probably is Firefox. Um, what I'll do here in this video to save you from searching the web and risking downloading something that isn't what you should have, I'll post the link to Google Chrome, to Firefox, and to Opera. Uh, these three together are probably the majority of all the browsers. Now, you might be using another one. If you're using something else in these three, I think you're advanced enough to know where to download your favorite browser. Uh, here, it's not a question of installing one over the other. You might say, well, is one better than the other? Honestly, they're all good browsers. Firefox is great. Google Chrome is okay. Uh, you know, just use what you like and you'll probably anyways end up using the one that you had on your previous computer. For the most part, once again, for most of you out there, Google Chrome will be your first choice. So in the description below the video, you'll have the link to download Chrome, Firefox, and Opera. Just click the link for the one that you want to install, follow the instructions on the screen, and you know what? You'll know that you downloaded it from a safe location. And that's why I did this video mostly, so that when you get that new computer and you have no clue where to get the software, you know that you can s click the link that's here. It's safe. It's okay. You'll get your browser. You're not going to get crap where read it. You're not going to get it from a website that's kind of shady and weird and, and maybe risk getting malware. So, you know, that's why I do these videos, to help out everybody to make sure that they are... Uh, that, that everything you do is correct. So, of course, you might see here at the bottom, I have, um, you know, Google Chrome, I have Firefox, I have uh, Edge Chromium. I, I've got pretty much all the browsers, but in my, my case, it's mostly for the, um, you know, the, the purpose of making videos of all the software and testing out. What my favorite browser is, is not necessarily uh, important uh, to anybody. It's really what you guys use that's important and make sure your browser is always at the latest version because that's the important thing also in staying safe always have the latest software including that web browser that you're using to browse the internet on if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching